dedication, loyalty. Yep. Alright guys, commercial was on. So anyways, I'm gonna react on My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Season 5, Episode 10. Princess Spike? Is Spike gonna be a princess? Let's begin. Three, two, one. Kids are lost. Hey, a crystal pony, a griffin. Welcome to the Grand Equestria Pony Summit. You delegates have traveled far and wide to represent your cities as we seek to celebrate and learn from all the unique places that make up our wonderful land of Equestria. At tonight's welcome reception, Princess Cadence will dedicate this beautiful friendship statue made up of gemstones from each of your home cities. Oh, actually, it looks impressive. Oh, wow. Now I'd like to turn Spike, things don't over eat to the it. one who organized the summit, Princess Twilight Sparkle. Twilight, why do you look so tired? Every time. With delegates from over 50 cities attending three days of conferences, receptions, and meetings, Twilight. this is the largest Grand Equestria Pony Summit yet. And let me tell you, putting it all together has led to more than one sleepless night. Oh. We're so excited to have you here. No and wonder you have bags on your eyes. All across this great land of ours. Give me your bags, have bags. And now my faithful assistant Spike would like to say a few words. Um... Hello, Epic Pony. I'm here to help any way I can. So if there's anything I can do for any of you... We love you, Princess Twilight! We love all the princesses! But not Spike. I mean, he's the one that saved a crystal yes, empire. Every pony loves a princess. I mean, did anyone not know Spike that he saved an empire from King Sombra? Oh, shit! Gesundheit. Princess Twilight? Oh, 
why even you say so? Yeah, I reckon I'll keep a few more hours. Good thing I got the princesses on my side. <laughs> hey! Hey! Twilight will be rested, Princess Cadence will be proud, and Princess Spike deserves a little reward. <laughs> Princess Spike. <laughs> Title drop. Where <laughs> are you something, all right? I work forever on this station. I know I have one. Uh, hey. Hi, uh, can I help you? My friend here, the distinguished pony from up Manhattan and I are, are in a bit of a pickle, and we need the Princess Twilight to resolve it. Why is this uh, cutie mark of talk a little pizza quieter? pizza? And maybe come back later? Oh, sure now. Gosh, I wish we could talk about We're both supposed to give speeches about our local economies in five minutes. And we've been booked in the same hall. I had the room first. And let's be honest, my speech is more important. Point of order there, sir. But I think you'll find that my speech is the more important one, don't you know? What don't you Noobs know? You're just going to have a lot of unhappy delegates on your homes unless we get a ruling from Princess Twilight right now. Uh, let me see what I can do. Does <sighs> 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 something need scheduling? Oh, uh, yeah. Two delegates and speeches booked in the same hall. What do I do? Okay, no problem. Just put the hay in the apple and eat the candle. Hmm? What? Huh? And Spike, did you oh, scream like a little girl? Answer. Well, I can't even think straight. Oh my gosh, what am I supposed to do? Uh oh. Well, what did she say? She picked me, right? Hey, hey, hey! Let's not be too hasty, there, good sir. I've got a feeling she went with me. <laughs> and your kitty mark is a cup me. of coffee. It ain't hard to see that as an insult to all of Manhattan. You know what I'm saying? And it'd sure be a shame to see something like a scheduling issue create a nasty old rift between Minneapolis and Ponyville. So, what did the princess say? Come on now, spit it out. Um, she said that. Uh... Well, she said that she she wants you to go away. Share it. Share it. If that's what the princess wants, what are you gonna do? The princess is always right. Now, like, you know, I'm feeling this is not about you and me. I have no right? yes. Now, back to more important things. What's up? Mm. Combining those two dots was a disaster. Wait, the what? hall was overcrowded and the speakers just shattered over each other. Huh? But Why would the princess have made such a decision? Wait, what? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. The crowd is coming. Shut up. I was really looking forward to the don't spend all your bed speech. But when I went into the hall, a pony had taken my seat. A pony who used to be my friend. Your friend took your seat? Wait. Huh, big deal. Why don't big you just do it? But I don't need some random dragon's opinion. I, I want to hear what Princess Twilight thinks. Ugh, fine. <laughs> Uh, the princess says no friendship should end over a seat. You should forgive your friend. Uh, of course! Oh, the princess is so wise. Oh. I couldn't tell these delegates anything as long as they think it came from Twilight. Hmm. All right, who's next? Oh, hey, uh, the Velvet or Matilda, yeah. Spikes. <laughs> 
telling lies, pretending like she's stuck, he's stuck in the toilet. Oh hey, a griffin! Nope, yes. Nope. Next. Next. Yes. So, how can oh, hey, Fancy Pants. Twilight be of service? Well, as host city, the Cantalon delegation feels it's only right that we should get passes to every meeting and party. Eh? Well, that doesn't seem fair. I mean, Princess Twilight doesn't think that seems fair. Uh, yes, yes. Very well. It was worth a try, though, wasn't it, old chap? Hmm? Ooh, this is great! I just took care of a whole bunch of stuff that Twilight won't have to worry about when she wakes up. Wonder if any pony else needs the princess's help. <laughs> Wonder if she's what she's doing. How she's doing. If I can check a few of these meetings off Twilight's schedule, then when she wakes up, she won't have to think about anything but the reception. Uh, says here you have a meeting with Princess Twilight? Uh, yep, for she wanted me to prep her on all the different gemstones and the citizens of Equestria statue before the reception tonight. Okay, go ahead. Um, well, I'd rather, um, sell the princess directly. Well, if it helps, you can call me Princess Spike. You mean... <laughs> no, 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 Seriously? It, it's alright. Uh, the princess asked me to take care of a few things for her. That's why I came to find you. Uh, if you say so. The princess says so. Uh, okay. Let's start with Popan. Where's the princess? I'm here for your two o'clock. You? But I'm supposed to be briefing Princess Twilight on the progress with the water main. I speak for the princess. Oh, wow. Uh, can I start fixing it again? I'm getting a little worried, to be honest. Yeah, looks Actually, like she's gonna break. Twilight still needs a rest. And her new annoyed policy is still in effect for a few more hours. Sorry. Hey, Spike. Oh, What's hey, Kate. What's going on? Uh, you know, just setting them up and knocking them down. What do you mean? Not only have I kept things quiet so Twilight could sleep, I also took care of all her afternoon meetings so she won't have to worry about them when she wakes up. Are you sure she'd want you doing that? There are so many things to keep track of at this summit. Nah, don't worry. I got it covered. I know Twilight so well, it's easy to make decisions like her. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for keeping Twilight's stress level down. As you're long welcome. As that's the real reason you're doing it. Well, why else would I be doing it? You're not enjoying speaking for Twilight a little bit? Enjoying it? <laughs> no way. The only things I'm doing by order of the princess are for the good of the summit. <sighs> Seriously, what's up with these commercials? <laughs> uh oh. <sighs> Order of the Princess. Oh, he's definitely. Order of the Princess. He's really taking it too far. <laughs> Order of the Princess. <sighs> princess knife is good. It sure is. Oh, but it's also hard work, isn't it? Eh, it's not so bad. Spike, I'm concerned you might be abusing your relationship with Twilight. What are you talking about? I'm a great princess. Friend. I mean, Twilight's a great princess, and I've been working hard to help her. When two delegates had a falling out, I'm the one who fixed her friendship. I listened to that pony going on about gems for 45 minutes so Twilight wouldn't have to. I moved the polo match away from the tower so she could sleep. And I didn't even eat that delicious looking statue. I'm a decision making master. Master? <sighs> okay. So maybe I did get a little carried away making decisions. But it's not like anything bad happened. Oh, like those things? Those guys and. Uh oh. Uh oh. Like. Oh no! The water! <laughs> This is all your fault. Robert. This is unexpected. I'll go shut off the 
shot. Why is it that my game? Yes. Wait, that's that no! Thank you. Okay. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. What have you done? Oh, bless me. Ow. Cluck me. A water main burst on Cadillac's most important day. Hang on, look at me. Princess Twilight said to start working on it. Well, what about these trees? I ordered them trimmed to avoid just such a situation. Well, the princess told me to stop, Bob. Why would the princess make such horrible decisions? This all could have been prevented. <laughs> you apologizing for? They were Princess Twilight's awful decision. I'm about to blow my dad on Princess Twilight, I'll tell you that for nothing. Yeah, me too. I'll not let Princess Twilight give Cantalot a bad name in the eyes of Equestrian. Come on, every pony, let's go give her a piece of our mind. Wait, 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 no, 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 no. Stop. Wait. Stop. <laughs> I mean, wait! What is it now? There's an angry mob here that demands satisfaction. It's just that uh, we don't want to wake the princess, do we? Wake her? What? You're telling me that she's asleep? <laughs> okay, everyone, shut up! <laughs> close door, close door! <sighs> oh, thank God. We must speak at once! She is sleeping! Uh oh. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, uh. I'm glad you're here, Spike. We've got a lot to do. Uh, twi you know Twilight. Water main was fixed? Uh, you seem well rested. I haven't slept like that since I was a filly. You haven't? Well, at least I got one thing right. And it was the one thing Cadence asked of me. Maybe I did do a good job today. Well, almost. Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong? Don't play games with me, princess. You know why I'm here. Is this about the special privileges you wanted? Because this seems a little extreme. D special privileges? The last thing on my mind is special privileges. What's going on, Spike? Um, <sighs> you needed to sleep. And Princess Cadence told me you weren't to be disturbed. Then there was this bird, and well, long story short... I've made a few decisions on your behalf. A few decisions? Well, maybe more than a few, but I had good intentions. Honest. Until I didn't anymore. I'm sorry, Twilight. Well, I guess I got a little carried away. It, it just felt so good to have ponies caring about my opinions on such important matters. I guess I was just enjoying feeling like a Princess. Well, Spike, one of the most important things a princess can do is realize when she's made a mistake and fix it. How do I do that? You could start with them. <laughs> uh, uh, hi there, everypony. What's up, ducks? So, I guess I owe you all a pretty big apology. It's funny, here we are at a summit that brings together ponies from all across Equestria. And all I could think about was myself. You all came here to celebrate the things that make each of our cities so unique and special. But instead of getting into the spirit of things like all of you, I used my friend's position to make myself feel good. Cantalot Ruby goes here, old sport. 
And R goes here, don't you know? You're up. Thank you, don't you know? <laughs> That's funny to say that. Why would they even say that? Don't you know? And voila, it's fixed. Does this mean you forgive me? Sure. You know, the whole idea of the statue is that when each of us plays our own small part, it adds up to something great. Quite. Just like how all our cities make up the beautiful land of Equestria. I hereby dedicate the citizens of Equestria statue to every pony who plays their part, no matter how big or how small. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. That's a... Oh, come on! Take over! Cause in tight. Yourself, Spike. So anyways, that's our reaction on Princess Spike. Remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell, and smash the bell. I'll see you guys next time.